And now it's time for talking with Joe. Joe Rose is live from the WQAM studios this morning. Joe Manny Diaz continues to do big things as the head coach at the University of Miami. Now, early this morning, very early this morning, highly touted quarterback transfer Tate Martell announced that, yep, he is now a hurricane. The four star QB attended Ohio State last season. He does have to sit out, though, for a year, so we got a little bit of waiting to do for him. Do you think this is the right fit, and what do you think this means for the team moving forward? Uh, I like what Manny Diaz is doing, and, and this is the first time, so this is brand new for Miami Hurricane fans. Transfers are becoming more and more popular, but when you're not doing well in high school recruiting, especially in the first batch, you, you lost so many recruits at the last second after coaches left and everything that happened. Uh, I like what he's done. He's got some guys coming in that are ready to play, that have experience. He's got five or six guys, got a couple more guys they're looking at right now, still waiting on Jalen Hurts to see whether he's going to go to Maryland or come to Miami. We should know real soon on that one as well. But he's got some guys that are four-star, a couple of five-star players, some guys from smaller schools that have experience that were recruited by a lot of big schools that have decided to come in. I love what he's doing. It's just brand new. Going to take a while for everybody to get used to because some of the graduate transfers, of course, mean they only have the one year. So they're ready to play. You're bringing them in, hoping and, and, and expecting those guys to be able to play right away in positions that you're shorthanded. So, hey, man, he's going all in to win right now on this thing. I love it. Don't <laughs> sit back and cry because you're losing high school recruits. Go out and get these transfers. transfers. They want to come here. They want to play. Let's do it. And Jeff Let's Thomas. And Jeff Thomas is actually returning. It looked like he was about to sign with Illinois, but it, or enroll in Illinois instead. Though he says he is uh, returning to the University of Miami. A lot of excitement around this as well. Is this just more of the Manny Diaz effect? Uh, I think so, but. Uh... <laughs> Jeff Thomas, he could be high maintenance. There's no question. Uh, I'm coming back. No, no, no. I don't know why I said that. I'm going back. To, I'll be there in classes in a couple of days, Illinois. I'll, oh, no, 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 no. Hey, understand, I'm going back to Miami. Apparently, the only guy they knew the whole time was the guy we've been talking about, Manny Diaz, the <laughs> coach. He uh, apparently had met with him, put the four up on social media. Everybody was going, oh, oh, what could this mean? So I'm Jeff Thomas is back. Media He's a great too. player. I'm loving that Manny Diaz oh. social media use. We'll talk more and, about and that, more I'm sure. And more importantly, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, by the way, more than that, the kids love his social media. I know my Very guys true. who follow all that stuff <laughs> thinks he's about as good as anybody they've seen with this social media stuff. So everybody's having fun responding to it. Yep. Uh, I'm going to have to get into this social do, media Joe. stuff, man. There it is. We'll give you a lesson. I was waiting for the rap. Right, we Joe, just got a four-star guy coming. named Rap. <laughs> he's in my ear. Too. Thank you. Joe, we'll talk more later. Bye-bye. <laughs>